will start off with Lynn. Halen Doyle getting the first goal of the game, and we thought that Lynn was going to keep up with the Rollins Tars. Then, Liz Fahey. You'll be seeing this a lot. Her first goal of the game on a free position. But Lynn tries to come back. Sydney Hill, the freshman, the catalyst to start off this game, gives him a two to one lead, and we thought Lynn was fired up and getting ready to go, but Gaston Gway had an answer for that one. Yeah, that was off a feed from Eden Cook. And Eden Cook saw Caroline and she's like, hey, if you can score a goal, I can also score a goal. As Eden Cook coming up here on the fast break, gets the opportunity and hits it on the top right part of the net as Brown takes the lead for the first time this game 2-3. Comes right back and Sammy Otomo, Logan, she says, I see you, Liz Fahey. Or Stump, excuse me, says, I see you, Liz Fahey. Anything I can do. Well, for Fahey saw that, and she's like, ah, I I'll show you how this is done. And gets her second field position, uh, free position goal of the game. Then this is This in. is Adamo. This is Adamo with another free position goal. That's the third for Rollins. Yeah, continuing the run, Logan. It was coming in heaps and bounds. Liz Fahey, guess what? Again, for her second goal of the game. And then Taylor Kenley gets one fired into the back of the net, and it's eight to two suddenly, Logan. Yeah, and then Caroline keeps going on the run, gets her second goal of the game, driving and kicking. She is the facilitator of this team, but gets a goal. And then Abigail Cauley gets her first goal, the freshman on the top right. Isabel Clark gets those back-to-back -back goals to end the half, Logan. She really, and, and Lynn really needed those to get into a flow and a rhythm, and we thought maybe Lynn was coming back as we see her hit both of these goals off some great drives towards the net. Unassisted, both of these by Isabel Clark. And here we go, here comes the momentum. Now we got Kaylin Doyle getting inside and getting the goal on Gabby Tanner. Justin, it's 10 to five. What is Rollins gonna do? Guess what, Liz Fahey. She closes the door and doesn't allow it to happen. Liz Fahey with number three, and then responding with another one, Abigail Cauley, the freshman, Logan. Absolutely, yeah. Abigail Cauley, we didn't think she, she was kind of slow at first, but this is her second goal of the game. Then coming up is Taylor Henley. Coming off a good pass and a drive and a swish. She almost backhanded that into the goal. Then Justin, the play of the game. Liz Fahey with the dive and the scoop and the score. She ended up getting hurt on the play, but she was able to come back. That's one of the best goals you'll ever see. Diana Doler, a girl that we didn't talk a lot about, the freshman who had four goals in her first game, responded, got in the scoring column, and you could see her right here off the free position, gets one to go. And then Coach Dennis Short was like, hey girls, we need to get at least one more goal before we get out of here. And Abigail Cauley delivered, getting the hat trick on the day, 